during an equinox which happens twice a year the sun is in its peak over the equator and the day and night are generally of equal length during those two days usually 20th march and 23rd september the subsolar point the area where the sun's rays shine perpendicular to the earth's surface is directly on the equator during these two days the earth's axis is not tilting toward or away from the sun but instead the center of the sun is in the same plane as the equator for example if the sun rises at 7 a.m. on the equinox, it will set 12 hours later at 7 p.m. A spot check on the streets of Nairobi established that not many Kenyans are aware of the astronomical event. It's very hot of late. Like, uh, it's, it is extreme. Yeah. Interestingly, the equinox has no influence on the temperatures contrary to information circulating on social media. I've come across it on WhatsApp uh -huh. and we've been advised to drink lots of water and eat fruits to stay hydrated. However, at this time the sun's rays are shorter and more intense. This means that the current hot weather being experienced in parts of the country is not due to the equinox but due to the spell which precedes the rain season. The coastal city of Mombasa is experiencing an abnormally hot weather with temperatures hitting a record of 35 degrees Celsius. Residents interviewed say they are worried temperatures soar to dangerous levels. They claim the meteorological department is unreliable when it comes to weather forecasts. The climate is unbearable. The fact that the residents or the citizens were not informed in advance by the meteorological department is a big failure on their part because people are being surprised. Apart, apart from the power failure, there is a lot of hotness. Mikuwa joto sana, watu wanakunywa maji, wanalala wakiwa wananguwa wengine, dirisha watu wanafungua, madirisha kwa wazi kabisa, hata inabida watu wengine na kanda ni maji kama samaki tu. To cope with the heat, the public, especially children and senior citizens, can take precaution by staying indoors as much as they can. Precaution should also be taken when engaging in outdoor activities by drinking more water to prevent dehydration. For KBC Channel 1 News Hour, Rose Kakuo.